Hi, I'm Brian with ericksontutoring.blogspot.com. Today we're going to discuss the basis for Mendel's principles. Um, Gregor Mendel uh, is often referred to as the father of modern genetics. Um, he studied pea plants in great detail. Um, he actually followed the physical characteristics of roughly 29,000 pea plants and very meticulously bred them on his own and uh, controlled breeding experiments quite a bit. Um, through his work, he came up with two uh, major laws. Um, the first one is the law of segregation, and the second is the law of independent assortment. The law of segregation states that um, during meiosis, so when sex cells are being formed, um, chrom each sex cell gets one allele. So one version of one gene. Basically what happens is you have chromosomes, homologous pairs, they separate, do, do their own thing, and then through the second stage of meiosis, each chromosome separates into two. So each individual um, gamete um, gets one allele of every gene. Uh, the second law, the law of independent assortment, um, says that the segregation of one allele doesn't impact the segregation of the second allele. So say you're looking at two traits, uh, maybe eye color and hair color. Um, your eye color, the, the gene, and um, in turn the allele that codes for eye color um, is gonna do its own separate um, segregation than the gene for hair color. So laws of segregation and laws of independent assortment um, were the basis of Gregor Mendel's works and contributions to the scientific community.